Hi, I'm Mike Hudson, Director of the Museum of the American Printing House for the Blind. Today we're on location up in APH's Educational Research Department. It's kind of appropriate for our mystery object this week, which is a reading pacer. Um, this device, you wind it up, you set the uh, speed, um, and then when you turn it on, it slowly advances the reading material underneath the window. You can kind of hear it working there. These were used uh, both to teach speed reading, but also researchers found in the 40s and 50s that if you controlled what you were looking at, for some readers, it really helped them to increase their reading comprehension and their reading speed. You know, sometimes you might see uh, somebody take a ruler and uh, literally focus their attention right on one line of the text and just move down the way. This thing worked kind of in the same way. In the 1960s, uh, researchers here at the American Printing House for the Blind looked at these devices, which were being used for print readers, and tried to decide, could this be used for Braille readers? Um, so Dr. Carson Nolan, who was head of our research department, did a lot of research with a device like this, working with Braille readers. Um, and published a paper in 1967. Um, I'm not really sure whether or not they concluded that um, it was good or bad, but I don't think these are used very much in schools today.